will want it protected. Peter Alders. Thank you very much, Mr Speaker. In East Anglia, there are, on the one hand, tremendous opportunities in such sectors as low-carbon energy and sustainable fishing, and yet, on the other hand, sig significant challenges with deep pockets of deprivation, particularly in coastal communities. I acknowledge the investment that has been made, but there is a concern locally that the government has yet to comprehend the scale of the opportunity that our region has to be a global exemplar in new and revitalised industries, and in doing so, bring transformative and long-term benefits to local people. Will my right hon. Friend meet with other East Anglian MPs and myself so that together we can put in place a strategy to realise the full potential of the East of England? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, uh, yes, Mr Speaker, but I, I, also, I also want to say uh, that I understand completely the massive opportunity uh, that exists in, and the potential that exists in those coastal uh, communities, and, uh, and that is why we are investing £120 million already in five uh, new towns deals, including uh, for Lowestoft, uh, Mr Speaker, and uh, I'm sure that my right honourable friend, the, the Secretary of State for, for levelling up, uh, will want to be uh, taking his points on board as we uh, bring forward the levelling up uh, white paper in the new year. Stephen Flynn. Thank you, Mr yeah. Speaker. Does the Prime Minister believe